On today's episode of Coach's Corner, we're going to tackle the issue of rattled joints when soft cutting. To get started, we're going to talk to Max Mork. Max Mork is a sales specialist here at Edge Construction Supply. And to get us started, Max, why don't you tell us what causes rattling in joints? There's three main reasons why uh, joints would rattle on a project. The first and the, and the most uh, relevant uh, would be that the blade isn't properly broken in. To uh, break in a blade properly, you'd want to run the saw uh, half RPMs of the motor uh, for the first 20 linear feet. Uh, the second would be that you're getting on the concrete too early. Uh, the way to tell that is your first 5 to 10 feet of cutting. So making sure that you're getting on in the green zone. The third would be to check the skid plate. It is recommended to change out the skid plate with every blade that you purchase and replace on your X-150s or soft cut saws in general. Thanks, Max. As contractors well know, sometimes rattle joints can lead to have them be repaired or in worst case, torn out and cause delays on the job. So now Max is gonna talk about how you can come back and fix those rattle joints without having to tear out the whole project. Awesome, thanks coach. Yeah, there's, there's one way that a contractor could uh, fix rattle joints on a current project. Uh, Husqvarna has developed a saw called Husqvarna X150D. It's their decorative saw. It's very similar to the Husqvarna X150, uh, except it has a little more weight and a different build. Uh, it allows this flange to go on the bottom, which then entails this radius blade. This radius blade will go into the current joint. It is not meant for cutting new joints. It's meant for the rattle joints. And essentially it creates a beveled edge. And that is one way that you can save your project from tear outs or removals. It can save you thousands of dollars. This decorative saw is a great asset to a fleet. Um, after contractors will see the end result, which you just saw in, in the picture above, that beveled joint is an art. And some can utilize that in their selling point going forward with the X150D made by Oscar Barna. Max, I know you're really passionate on this topic. Do you want to explain to your story of your contractor you saved thousands of dollars with? Yeah, there was one instance. I had a, a customer that had some ra joints rattle on a project. Uh, they were asked to, to you know, fix the rattle joints or tear out and remove the concrete that was already poured and cut. Um, they went with the X150D and they fixed all their joint raveling by beveling the edges with this radius blade and the decorative saw and they saved thousands of dollars on the project. Um, not only in, in materials, concrete, but also in labor. With a special thanks to Max Moore for joining us on this episode of Coach's Corner. That about sums up everything on decorative saw blades. If you guys have any questions, comments, or if you have any problems in the field, feel free to leave comments or contact your sales rep today. Thank you. And we'll see you in the next video.